morning. Not the best start to this week. I've just been to Birmingham wholesale market and I'm on my way home. I wanted I wanted to get up early at four and get out the door by half four so I could be to Birmingham back again by eight o'clock. It's now it's gone nine. I don't know what it is, quarter past nine. And I've been stuck in traffic for an hour on this motorway over here. How much services? So uh, running a bit late and to make it worse there was a banana shortage so the bananas were expensive and there was no other fruit really it was pretty crap. So it's been a bit of a waste of a day so far and I'm trying to get home so me and the wifi can get down the doctor's surgery to register and they're only open till 12 because it's a little offshoot one. Um, so I've just discovered I have used a shortcut out the back of these services onto uh, some back roads so I'm going to try that and try and get home a bit quicker because it's a bit crap so far. We're doing lunch on the road today and we got lucky because uh, Dunks found some stuff in the reduced section. So I'm trying this carrot pastrami wrap. Basically we were headed to um, the hub so Riley could do some soft play and she fell asleep on the way. So we went to Daily Bread instead, picked up some food, and then we went to Tesco so we could have some lunch because by the time we get out of the hub, it's going to be dinner time. So it's just been a morning of errands, right, Ducks? <laughs> so, uh, yum, yum. Ducks has a different thing up there. You want to pass me the kung fu? Yeah, he's got this as well. We've got a kung fu bowl, miso rice topped with broccoli, and special treat. Come on, special treat. <laughs> Because Easter's coming up. Mini chocolate chip hot cross buns. Vegan. Wow! All the balls came flying down on you. We've got Chef Riley in the kitchen. Hey, Riley. <laughs> you look so cute. Just like on Yeah. Opening, opening. Every chef needs a sous chef. Who's that for? Felting Riley a snowball. Oh, yeah. Because that's a starting point. I'm teaching myself how to needle felt with bamboo because you can't really get needle felted things anywhere that I've come across that aren't made of wool, which is not vegan. So I've got to do it myself. <laughs> Who's trying to because I really like too. things like the Waldorf Steiner philosophies, but they rely a lot on wool. So I've got to make everything myself. Monkey, so watch out, she's angry. But it's still a natural material. Do you want your snowball? <laughs> she wants the ball. So it is a ball that holds together and now she on wants its own. The needle. I can condense it more. But it did start out as loose fibers. Wow. And it's no longer loose fibers, so I'm proud of myself. Your first ball. My first ball made out of bamboo roving. Yeah, yeah. You can't have the needle, sorry. It's a winner. Baby. You want to play with the snowball? You want to throw it? Yeah, <laughs> let's throw the snowball. Come, let's go throw the snowball. You got to walk your feet. Yay! Mama, do. Do what? No, Riley do. Riley do. Nino, Nino, Nino. Nino, Nino, Nino. Do you love it? Well, this is better than the other day was. I think Riley's decided it's too cold and she's too tired for this to be fun. <laughs> what evil parents.
and then come up. Today's project. I think I'm gonna leave this netting up where it is, but I've got to remove all of the vining. And I've got this idea, because the vines look quite nice and dried out, that if I'm careful about not breaking them up too much, if I can manage to get them out without um, Mama, having to make them into two small pieces, um, I think I'm going to try soaking them in some water and then fashioning them back into a wreath and letting them dry back out. Because that could be a fun little project to do with Riley. What do you hair. think? Mama hair. What's over here? Yeah. Ooh, what is it? No. Snow. She sees the little uh, white little balls in there and she thinks it's snow. Aww. No, daddy. Dirty. Daddy. No, daddy, mama. Oh, it's daddy. Okay. Oh my cat. This project is being accomplished literally by me taking the vines and just pulling them until they break off. I did take out a pair of scissors, but Riley's, um, she's taken them from me basically. <laughs> Toddler with sharp objects. It's cold. Just having a break. Not really a break. Don't tell anyone I'm having a break. I'm waiting for my buddy, but I'm reading his paper. Look at this. Can you see that? Could you go vegan? I'm going to read it and find out. Maybe I'll go all hippie and go vegan. Well, it does say a great taste test by our food and drink experts, who are probably not vegan. Put her face again. Anyway, yeah. See what it's about. I might go vegan later today. Uh, I've managed to rip all of that off of here. I've still got some over here, but she is getting tired of waiting for me and when the camera's not rolling she's whining <laughs> as soon as I turn the camera on she stops because she seems to like to pretend look at that grumpy face do you want to go inside and have mama. some chips mama cooked you up some chips come on <laughs> what are these men guarding treasure yeah. it's the king's treasure it yeah. Counted out and locked up tight with men to guard it day and night. Mm. Daddy trying to read Riley to sleep. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Bore her to sleep. <laughs> She's like, no, never! Sleep! Sleep! Go to bed, Riley. This is your bedtime night -night. story, monkey. All nap time. Nap time at nearly dinner time. Are we sleeping? Doggy. Doggy. Red book. Daddy, red book. I'm reading. Is someone yeah. hiding under the table? Catch! You got it! Whee! <laughs> oh! Uh oh! Uh oh! For it to Riley. Yeah! Uh oh! Uh oh! You're too lazy to get it yourself. <laughs> Throw it to Jacob. It? Throw it to Jacob. Whee! Oh. Do rock a bye baby. Rock a bye baby. Daddy roll. All around, but no help could be found. The dragon drew nearer and licking his lips said, Maybe this once I'll have witch without chips. You're really into that, Dunks. Thank you. It doesn't look like Riley's into it, though. No. She's got her own book. I did offer to read that one, but she told me off and said, carry on. <laughs>
Can I read this one? Hi, whale. Did you Can hear? I read this one? <laughs> she just said, hi, whale. Oh, whale. Whale. Fitting that she wants to read the snail on the whale while she's wearing her Daddy, whale dress. Oh, no, it's oh look, is that the cat? Look, I reckon that's the same cat as this cat. Is it really? Yeah, look. Yeah. Mm. Yo, Mama Bear. Mommy. Mama Bear. Yo, Mama Bear. Whose head torch is that? Why, Mama Bear. Can you find Mama Bear? Where is she? Yeah. You found her? Oops. Oh no! Oh no! <laughs> Head torch fell off. Daddy fix it. <laughs> Daddy fix it. Look, it's only there. Just got home from work and the house is really quiet. And I thought Rue might be sleeping, but she hasn't had a nap for the last two days. But as I come through here, <laughs> look at that. They're in the garden having fun without me. Hmm, not sure she's keen on the strawberry patch. Oh, blimey. Be careful. Oi! My strawberries. She's not listening. They go out and play with them. Where are you, monkey? <laughs> wow! She's in the fire truck. And we're not going to get her out for an hour. <laughs> Are you happy? Nino, Nino. Mama's gone shopping. Just me and you, kiddo. <laughs> All right, apparently I'm having an early midlife crisis because this is about to happen. Now, I think I'm making a bigger deal of it in my mind than it actually will be because I have a feeling this is semi-permanent. It's not a permanent um, color. Um, and because my hair is dark, I don't think it'll actually show up very much, um, which is good for me at the moment because I'm not really, I'm not a teenager anymore. I used to wear purple hair when I was young, but I am not young. <laughs> but I do want to have a little bit of a change because like I said, midlife crisis, right? So... This is about to happen. And I figured while I'm at it, I might as well throw this on my face just to, you know, extra glow. It's been a really, really rough few weeks with Riley's teething and a really rough last few days because she has been crazy the past few days. So I think that's probably why I really need this pick me up right now. I need to feel like my own person a little bit and not like I just belong to her. <laughs> All right guys, it has been about an hour and it is time to wash this out. Out on the morning run. It's marathon training season. I think we got 16 weeks to go to Edinburgh. I keep trying to catch the uh, local wildlife. That's not the local wildlife on camera, but I'm too noisy. It disappears before I get there. So that's my hair, guys. I'm pretty sure you guys can't see it 
at all in the camera, but it basically just shines in the light purple. And I really like it. Dunks doesn't even see it. <laughs> Looks wonderful, honey. He doesn't even see it. But um, I didn't want it to be bright. I think he thought I was gonna have like actual purple hair. Can you guys see anything? No, it doesn't really show up on camera, does it? It doesn't make a difference on the camera, really. Anyway, maybe it'll show up when we go out. I don't think so, though. Um, I did also want to show you guys, because I showed you guys when I was making Riley that snowball. I did finish the snowball, and I really like how the snowball came out. Came out. I was going to say came out. Um, I like how it came out, but I'm not sure where it is at the moment to show you guys. It looks like a snowball. It's just a white ball, right? It doesn't look much different than it did when you guys saw it. But I've also made her a corn and a carrot. And that's all I've had time to make this week, so. But how cute! That was the needle felting that I was doing um, earlier in the week. Um, so I want to try to make her some more things, I just don't know what to do next. Um, an animal, I don't know. She's eating over there. We're trying to get her to go out and she doesn't seem to want to leave the house. Playing with your new watering can monkey. In the freezing cold. She's doing a great job of watering the strawberries. Daddy, daddy. And what? You might call herself. Daddy. The punch soaking. And she's shaking daddy, like a nutter, daddy. aren't you? Daddy dear, you don't want to go in yet? Hey, I go inside. You want to go inside? Yeah? <laughs> <laughs> Okay, should we go in? Go in, Okay, let's go. What you doing, Riley? Mama. Yes? You making a cake? Daddy made cake. Daddy made cake. No, that's not even made cake. I think all three of us have helped make this cake. Mm -hmm. It's a family effort. 